in life, there are two things that you work hard for. It's either you working hard for life or you working hard for death. You gotta ask yourself, you gotta pick. Every day you wake up, you gotta ask yourself, are you working hard to live or are you working hard to die? And a person that I was cool with, I wouldn't say is my friend, but every time we seen each other, we greeted each other with love. Lost his life last night. Right. And I'm making this video because I need you guys to understand when you wake up in the morning, I'm going to say it again. Are you working hard for life or are you working hard for death? I see a lot of people that I grew up with. Um, a lot of people that I was once friends with, they are working hard for death, right? Every day they wake up and they non-productive. They wake up uh, selling drugs, waking up doing drugs, waking up uh, uh, constantly um, getting into it with people, man women constantly arguing constantly beefing in this life you gotta ask yourself are you gonna work hard to live or are you gonna work hard to die both take work you gotta ask yourself which one do you want to work for right if you waking up every day and you doing drugs smoking cigarettes eating unhealthy food guess what you're working hard for death but if you're waking up every day, trying your best to eat the right food, trying to work out, um, paying attention to the things that you put into your body, living righteous, right? No jealousy, no enviness, no negativity, always trying to be positive, then you're working hard for life. Both take work. Both take work. No one's perfect. I'm not asking you to be perfect. I'm asking you to work more harder for life than you do death. When we sit back and we see people for tens and twenties of years work hard for death. And then once they get what they work for, we all want to look in shock. We all want to look like we didn't know what was coming. It's living reality. If you see a person wanting to be a gangster all their life, y'all gotta y'all gotta answer this. What do gangsters get? You either get it's only two ways: dead or in jail. Dead or in jail. Dead or in jail. The ones that are out here who are playing for gangsters, they're not gangsters. Right? They not gangsters. I need you guys to understand that. So when we watch a person live a life of foolishness and then a person get what they work hard for, there's no way that we can be shot. There's no way that we can be said. That person worked hard for that. See, when you're waking up every day and you're being positive and you're reading, you're studying, you're waking up every day with the intent to get better, right? What, what do you think the outcome is going to be? Right? You working hard for life. You working hard to live. You working hard so your family, so your loved ones, right? You can be here and enjoy this life with them. But when you waking up every day packing guns for no reason. Pack, packing, let me correct that. Packing guns on the terms of I'm beefing with such and such over a woman. I'm beefing with such and such because he didn't pay me a hundred dollars. Uh, I'm beefing with such and such because he took this from me. Yeah, when you live in a life like that, when you live in a life not respecting no one, robbing, killing, taking from others, what do you think you are gonna get? You are working hard for death. When you waking up constantly negative, arguing, right? Waking up every day with a constant attitude, what do you think you are gonna get? Listen, man, I used to live that life. I used to work hard for death every day. I used to work hard for death every day. 
but I am glad that the Most High put it upon me, right? And let me see the light. Let me experience new life. Uh, put different people around me, right? Because I was waking up every day, selling drugs, packing guns, shooting guns, fighting at the club every, every weekend, running around with people that I shouldn't be running around, uh, being in certain situations that I shouldn't be in, being in certain houses that I shouldn't be in. Right? I was working hard for it. I was working hard for that death. But now I realize, right? Now I realize I shouldn't be working hard for that. I should be working hard to be a father. I should be working hard to be a husband. I should be working hard to be an upstanding man of my community. I should be working hard to be a leader. I should be working hard to be a CEO. I should be working hard to run my business. I should be working hard for all positive things and all things that have a positive outcome on my life. This is why I don't shed tears when someone passes away and they get what they worked hard for. How can I shed tears when you worked hard for that? Man, you wanted that. Thumbs up. I do not shed tears when someone go to jail. You worked hard to get in that jail cell. Thumbs up. You got what you want. And when we live in reality, we must understand the most high, the universe will give you what you want if you work hard for it. Yeah. If you wake up every day and you want to be the biggest drug dealer on the planet, the universe, the most high will give you what you want, but you must accept what comes with it. I'm going to talk about that in the next video. So I need you guys to understand, ask yourself, what are you working hard for? They both take work and you will get what you put the most work in. I love y'all. Peace.